This is Bob Payne, Chief Investment Strategist here at Payne Capital Management with this week's market update. This week on the Street of Dreams, the stock market staged a dramatic turnaround late in the week, pushing the major indices higher and snapping a four-week losing streak for the Dow. The rally was sparked by comments from Atlanta Fed President Rafael Bostic. Bostic stated that he is open to further rate hikes pending new data, but investors only listened to his comment that he expects the Fed would be in a position by mid to late summer to pause interest rate hikes. The bond market also rallied, with the 10-year Treasury yield slipping to 3.96% Friday after closing above 4% for the first time since November. Now, markets have largely been shrugging off the recession rhetoric of bearish economists as the discourse has migrated from the beginning of the year when the consensus view was that the economy was on the verge of a hard landing to a new consensus that a soft landing was increasingly likely, and now to a rapidly growing consensus of a no landing scenario with no recession or even an earnings slowdown in 2023. Now, stronger than expected economic data continued to come in this week, supporting the no landing scenario. Two readouts released Friday on the health of the U.S. services sector showed relatively robust spending in February. The S&P Global U.S. Services PMI Index rose to 50.6 in February from 46.8 in January. That's the highest reading since June, and it pushed the 50 threshold that signals expansion. Now, similar data for the Eurozone and China showed that activity in the services sector in both markets expanded this month. The ISM Institute for Supply Management Services Activity, the ISM Services Index, decreased slightly to 55.1 in February from 55.2 in January, but exceeded the consensus forecast of 54.3 among economists polled. So what is it going to be? A hard landing, a soft landing, or no landing? Well, time will tell. But rather than get hung up on the ever-changing view of economists, we think it's best to stay invested. You see, stocks are leading indicators. They move ahead of earnings and recover long before the economic recovery is verified. So in the spirit of former President Ronald Reagan, as an investor, you should trust, but diversify. Hey, my son Ryan and I, we have 70 years of combined industry experience in building low-cost, tax-efficient, gold-based portfolios. For your free evaluation, all you need to do is text or call us right now at 844-752-6692. That's 844-752-6692, or just simply call 844-PLAN-NYC. That's 844-PLAN. NYC. Hey, this is Bob Payne. I'm the Chief Investment Strategist here at Payne Capital Management.